I feel, I think like so many of us, we feel a sense of renewed purpose, I guess. Um, a sense of ownership in trying to participate instead of just watching and putting things on Facebook. And, um, I feel like this, this needs to become a public issue for everybody. And for too long, most of us that are uh, white have just sort of stood by and watched what's been happening and um, not participated. And I think that's got to change. Um, going beyond, the, beyond this mural for me is about meeting the list of demands that uh, we have given to the city. It's about abolishing the police. And I know a lot of people don't want to hear that, but that's the truth. It's about receiving equity um, when it comes to education, housing, resources. Um, this mural is just a statement to say like, we're here and we're not going anywhere. You can't erase us. But this mural is just for folks, like it's for you to see, it's for you to interact with, but the movement's so much bigger. Well, kind of what it means to me is like, um, you know, I, I was always wondering, you know, if, if, uh, if, if stuff I see on social media is actually a movement or if people are just following a trend. Um, when we do events like this, it's kind of a reminder that this really is a movement. Um, it's not, we're not out here to get Facebook likes or anything like that because a lot of these injustices have been going on, uh, you know, years prior to social media, years prior to the information age that we are in now. And now that we are in this age, it's important to do events like this and things like this to kind of, you know, show that we all come together for a good cause and, and to show that we are brothers and sisters and and just be a part of the community.